Hey y'all, so this is going to be a fast makeup tutorial on a zombie girl with nails and pins and all that ooey gooey stuff. Okay, so I got some rubber latex, liquid latex from a special effects store, which I got for about $16. I also got some really cool coagulated blood gel and the rest of the materials you can literally find at your house or just at the dollar store. So first and foremost, rip bits and pieces of tissue paper. Make sure it's only one ply. Mix very little of your rubber latex with some water and make sure that it's this texture that it's not too thick. So take a brush and put some of that rubber latex on your face and stick a little bit of tissue paper and then put some more rubber latex over top of that. Make sure that it's not too thick so it can dry out really, really fast. So after a few minutes, you can see that the rubber latex dries out uh, clear. So you can apply your second and third coat, making sure that the rubber latex is dried in between. Okay, so for this part, you got to be really careful. You want to take your tweezers and just pull um, outwards a little bit of the skin so it creates that effect that your skin's actually blown up and peeling and all that mushy gooey stuff. Okay, now you want to take some foundation or concealer and blend that baby with your skin. Uh, make sure that it's the same color as your skin, obviously. Next, I blended up some black and red cream makeup from the dollar store and that just creates the um, almost kind of swelling around your skin. So for this part, I really, really, really got excited to do it, but it could actually be done um, the very last thing. So you want to take some clips and take some nails and you can put that through that fake latex and it just creates that really gross illusion. Then after, you can put the coagulated blood or even whatever like red paint you have at home and start um, painting inside the skin. You see how those nails and stuff just really got in the way? I mean, come on, get it together, girl. So for a more dramatic effect, you can put more blood around your mouth, your nose, um, under your eye or whatever. You can add as much shadow effect or more contouring effect Put a little bit of dark lipstick and you're basically done. So thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope that it really helps you and it gets you, you know, looking really gross for Halloween. Please subscribe for weekly DIY projects. And if you want to see more Halloween tutorials, click on the link below. Thank you. Bye.